And BGW said that one of the hopes that they had in partnering with organizations like us is that not only are we trying to reach people in our community, but also we have a ministry opportunity to try to reach the contractors and every person who walks on the job site. That really made us excited because we too have that same mission in mind. And so we really uh, were very intentional about the ministry through the construction process. And we found it, it was a real way to engage the whole church to be a part of the process. And so we created some teams and every single day during the construction process, we provided drinks and snacks and food. You know, it's Florida, it's hot. And so for them to have a cold Gatorade or water and to come over and have an area, picnic tables in the shade where we can thank them them and appreciate them and encourage them for what they did, that really just made it a very unique experience that I think most of these subcontractors had never experienced before. They were constantly thanking us and appreciating us for serving them. Uh, it also great, gave us a great avenue to you know, build a relationship with them. We have seen some fruit from that as well. Um, we have a particular story where during the process, we had a contractor who was awarded a bid. He was going through a really difficult time in his life. And one Sunday, he actually showed up at Cross Point and revealed that he was just going through a really difficult time. And ultimately, he rededicated his life to Christ. He's been coming to Cross Point ever since. He's in fact in my small group that meets every week. And I would never have met him. And you know, God used Cross Point's building project to bring him back to God. And what an incredible testimony and story.